Hello and welcome. I hope that you are having a fantastic day today. We're going to talk about eToro and the copy trader account that I've set up on eToro. I've spent over two years and thousands of hours writing a computer program that helps to buy and sell or pick when to buy and pick when to sell cryptocurrencies. And I want to make that program and its activity available to you. And to date, I've chosen eToro's copy trader program in order to make that available for you. So I want to share this with you. We're going to cover some exciting stuff because in November, um, the, the program I've written had picked the right cryptocurrencies in order to have a 49% gain. In fact, the biggest winners that the crypto that the algorithm picked out actually did spectacular. So we're going to get right into that. Plus, if you watch all the way to the end of the video, I'm going to show you how to make 50 bucks. In fact, eToro has a limited time offer and it's limited by the number of people. I can help 10 people get $50 for setting up to be a copy trader of my algorithm. And so all you need to do is set up an eToro account, use $200 to follow me in copy trading, and eToro within 30 to 45 days-ish uh, will deposit an extra $50 into your account. But let me give you the details about how to do that. It'll be at the end of the video, so be sure to watch all the way to the end. All right, so, this is what eToro looks like, and this is my picture and my information. And in order to find it, you can go to eToro's website and in the search bar up here, let me cover that. This is the search bar right here. You can just type in Lumen8, right here is where I spelled it, L-U-M-I-N and the number eight. All you have to do is put in Lumen8 into the search bar, hit the enter key, and you'll find a picture of me so that you can actually start copy trading. And when you're ready to actually start copy trading, you just click this copy button and eToro will take you through the other steps, but basically you'll tell it, uh, eToro has set it up so that you, you have to do a minimum of $200, but of course, They'll allow you to do more if you want to. You could do 2,000, 20,000, even 200,000 to copy trade me. So what is my YouTube channel all about? And should you buy Bitcoin now or should you wait? Well, my YouTube channel is here to give you ideas to help you take profits and avoid losses. Can we get this video to 99 likes? Smash that like button. It really helps us out a lot. Also, this is our disclaimer. I'm not a financial advisor. The things I'm gonna share with you is not financial advice. I'm gonna share with you things that are my opinion and my experiences from using eToro. As always, cryptocurrency involves substantial risk of loss and is not suitable for every investor. Now, I strongly recommend that you take a good look at this paragraph, but you know, really this paragraph is great advice no matter what you're investing in. It's currently written specifically for cryptocurrency because that's what we talk about on this channel. Now, I want to start not with my eToro uh, trades, but I want to start talking about Bitcoin and its performance so far this year because that will give you a great frame of reference for the rest of this. So Bitcoin's price year to date on January 1, 2020, it was running, you could buy a whole Bitcoin for $7,174. Now, as always, you don't have to buy a whole Bitcoin. You can buy smaller pieces of Bitcoin. In fact, if you buy 50 sats, a sat is a Satoshi. If you buy 50 sats, that's worth one penny. On uh, December 1st of 2020, Bitcoin kissed, almost hit the $20,000 mark. So it kissed and hit $19,950 on December 1st, 2020. And so that year to date value, the year to date value for all of this comes out to a whopping 
uh, 278%, which for any asset that you're investing in to get 278% in a single year is spectacular. But my algorithm actually outperformed that and it did it with Bitcoin. Let me show you what I mean. We set up our eToro account and the first trade we made in the eToro account was on October 14th, 2020. At that time, Bitcoin was selling for $11,429. Now on December 2nd yesterday, because today is December 3rd, Bitcoin was selling at $18,844. It's actually gone up a little bit since then. Right now, Bitcoin is trading at about $19,400. Today is December 3rd. So this current value that I have here is actually gone up. But in 49 days, in 49 days, we have seen a current value of 165% in a very, very short period of time. I mean, that's, that's pretty spectacular. You can't argue with those kinds of numbers. That is great. But Bitcoin was not our best performer in terms of the portfolio that we have out there on eToro. No, it wasn't. The best performer was actually XRP. And so we also purchased XRP on the same date, October 14th. At that time, XRP was selling for 25 cents. And since then, XRP has gone up quite nicely and is currently, as of December 2nd, selling for 60 cents. So in that very short period of time of 49 days, 49 days, we have seen a gain of uh, 238%. And so whatever dollar amount you had put into XRP on October 14th, that money is now worth 238% of that original investment. In 49 days, when you think about stocks, or real estate or any other kind of an investment, it's extremely rare to see something go up in 49 days to equal 238% of its original value. And that happens a lot with cryptocurrency, but it's happening even more because we're now entering in, Bitcoin and cryptocurrency kind of has a four year cycle. And that four year cycle um, is, is happens because of Bitcoin going through a halvening. But when Bitcoin starts going up, the entire cryptocurrency market also does the same. And that's why you see Bitcoin doing 165% in 45, 49 days and other cryptocurrencies doing significantly more like 238% during the exact same 49 days. And so this is this is one of the best, I need to do this. This is one of the best. Now, this is my opinion. I'm not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice, but in my opinion, we are on the verge of the next big bull run. If things work out in the same patterns that they did in 2017, when Bitcoin hit its all time high of $20,000, then we should see Bitcoin hitting all-time highs in December 2021. Now, Citibank agrees with that analysis. Citibank set out a professional portfolio, a professional report, not a portfolio, but a professional report to its investors. And their Citibank's investment advice said that they expect Bitcoin to hit $250,000 somewhere in the $250,000 price per Bitcoin by December, 2021. That means if they're right and you put money into Bitcoin, uh, that means you'll get a 10 times return on your investment in the next 12 months. So sometime in one year from now, if Citibank is right 
And in my opinion, I think they're correct. I think we're going to see a similar $200,000 to $300,000 Bitcoin sometime in December 2021. A time will tell, uh, but that's, that's kind of where my mind frame is at and I wanted to share that with you. Now, one of the great things about eToro is it is super easy to use. I've used a number of different companies to, to do uh, buying of stocks, as well as I've used lots of different exchanges to buy cryptocurrency. None of them are easier than, than uh, eToro. So eToro. And when it comes to, once you have your account and you log in, if you don't want to copy trade me, if you want to do your own thing, you can just click the buy button and eToro will ask you how much in dollars or how much in uh, uh, cryptocurrency, like do you want to buy one Bitcoin or do you want to buy $50 worth of Bitcoin? And so once you click the buy button, it walks you through that super easy, super simple to do. Uh, it, I have not seen an easier way to purchase cryptocurrency, but I also haven't seen an easier way to purchase stocks in the stock market. And so also I wanted to share with you, if you click right here, come on, right there on the, the either the Bitcoin symbol, the uh, Bitcoin icon or on the letters or words for Bitcoin, you can find out more about Bitcoin and it'll pull up this page on Bitcoin. You can do that with any of the cryptocurrencies listed here uh, on this page. This is the watch list page. And once you've purchased cryptocurrency or once you've started to copy trade me, you will have a portfolio built at that point. And when you click on the portfolio link, it'll show you a similar page with a listing of these different cryptocurrencies. The portfolio one will only list the cryptocurrencies that you actually have money invested in and the watch list will list out all cryptocurrencies unless you've done something like set up a filter or something similar. And when you click on the Bitcoin icon or any of the icons for any of these cryptocurrencies, it'll take you to a page that gives you information about that cryptocurrency. Very easy, very super useful, extreme, I mean, just really good. Um, and you'll see that there's three different buttons here. The feed gives you information that people are posting about that cryptocurrency. The stats show you the monthly and annual statistics for that crypto. The chart will show you a chart of price action on a day-to-day -day basis. And then the research tab lets you do research into that cryptocurrency and learn more about it. And so really easy in terms of getting more information. And if you decide that you want to trade or buy uh, that cryptocurrency, just click the trade or buy button. Uh, on this page, we saw a buy button. Right here is a buy button. And on this page, they gave a different button called a trade button, but it all basically does the same thing. One of the other trades that my algorithm recommended was getting into Ethereum. And if you're a cryptocurrency enthusiast, you know exactly what Ethereum is. It's the second largest cryptocurrency out in the world today. And we didn't buy Ethereum on day one because my algorithm didn't say it was time to buy Ethereum, but we bought it 43 days ago. My algorithm made the recommendation on October 20th to get into Ethereum. And at that point, Ethereum was selling for $373. Now that we've been in uh, uh, Ethereum for 43 days, the current price is $581. And so we've seen, didn't want to do that. Give me a second. We have seen a nice gain of 156 the current value of anything that we had invested in ethereum on october 20th the current value would be 156 percent of the initial investment and so that is in 43 days that's a spectacular investment another one that we did was into a cryptocurrency called ada ada We've currently been invested in that. My algorithm recommended it uh, on October 24th. So we've been invested in it for 39 days. 
and on October 24th, uh, ADA was selling for 11 cents per coin, and on December 2nd, 2020, it's now selling at 15 cents per coin. And so that gives us a current value on any dollar we invested of 137%. Again, that's a tremendous gain in just 39 days. 39 days for 137%. I'm really pleased with the performance of the algorithm. And I wanted to share a little bit about what it took to create this algorithm. So I've been working on this thing for two years. Now I have a full-time job. I'm not wealthy, I'm not rich, I'm just a regular guy. Um, my full-time job is in computer programming. I've been doing computer programming for 20 years. And during that 20 years, I've learned probably two things about computer programming. All right, so I'm being facetious. I've learned a lot in 20 years about computer programming. And my experience, my 20 years of experience, helped me build this algorithm for cryptocurrency. Um, but I've been doing this for two years now in the evenings and weekends when I wasn't uh, working. And it's taken me thousands of hours in testing. And so I'll build, I'll do a little bit of work, and then I'll run a test and see how that worked. Did I get better performance or did it give worse performance? And then I'll make some changes, I'll get some ideas, I'll do a few other things, I add a few more features and yada yada, and on and on the process has gone on for two years. But I've put in thousands of hours in writing computer program and, and testing the code and, and all of that kind of stuff. So what does this algorithm actually do? Well, whenever we kick it off, and I kick it off once a day, because the algorithm is set up to give me a daily price recommendation. It's not hourly, it's not every five minutes, it's once a day. And so when we make trades, we'll make those trades on a daily basis. And as you've noticed from most of what I've talked about, we, we don't just do willy-nilly a lot of trades, but rather my algorithm recommends us to be in trades for anywhere around 35-ish days on average. The losers, it tends to be somewhere around 20 days on average. The winners, it tends to be around 40, 45 days on average. But that can go quite a bit longer. I've had some winning trades where the algorithm went for 90 days and some losing trades where the algorithm said, get out after one or two days. And so it all depends on what the math in the program tells us to do, what its recommendation is. So here's how the algorithm works. First thing was it goes out and it talks to an external website to get the current cryptocurrency prices. Once the algorithm has downloaded those prices, it stores those prices in a database. Once it has the database, then it begins to evaluate all of that price information. Now currently, the algorithm has 110,000 records stored with price information. Each record has a specific date, it has a specific cryptocurrency, it has the open, close, high and low prices, as well as volume and some other information about that cryptocurrency in terms of what happened on that specific day for that specific cryptocurrency. And the algorithm does hundreds of thousands of calculations as it comes up with its recommendations. And when it's done with all of those calculations, it will give recommendations. And those recommendations will be on some days it'll say, hey, buy this crypto or sell this crypto. And on other days it'll say, do nothing. So it just depends on what decisions the algorithm comes to. But it's really pretty simple in terms of the output. It either says buy it, sell it, or don't do anything with it. Um, now the algorithm is using mind-numbing math. Mind-numbing math. Uh, the truth is, if I had to do what this algorithm does by hand, I would never be able to do it. It does so many hundreds of thousands of calculations every single day when it runs. I'm just thankful that we have fast computers with a lot of memory um, because if I had to use the computers that were available to us say back in the 1990s, 
it, it would be much, much more difficult. So this algorithm runs through thousands of mathematical calculations for each recommendation it makes. Um, and really, in some cases, it's running through a lot more than just thousands, tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands. It's, it's really cranking the numbers. You may have noticed on some of the pages that I had this eToro website. If you want to go to my eToro trading, you can, you can go to eToro.com slash people slash Lumen8 Algo Trader, and that'll pull up my portfolio um, and my... Uh, my cryptocurrency setup on uh, eToro. All right, so once you're at that website, uh, the one I just mentioned back here in this guy, come on, there we go. Uh, once you go to this page, this web page, it will actually take you to this web page here. This web page is on the eToro website. It is my account, Luminate Algo Trader. You'll be able to see uh, the feed here is different information that I post. So as I'm creating videos, I'm beginning to post those videos on the eToro feed. It'll also give you statistics so you can see my current statistics. You'll be able to see my portfolio, what coins and cryptocurrencies we're currently invested in. And you'll be able to see a chart that gives you a daily breakdown on our profits and losses. So you'll see a chart that shows you exactly how well or how poorly my algorithm is currently performing. And so in kind of in conclusion, I wanted to bring up, you know, eToro, e is not only easy to use, but it can also be really, really profitable. I mean, in just 49 days, we had a 238% current value on the money we invested into XRP. And while that sounds really large, if my back testing comes into reality, um, because we've back tested all the way back to 2010 with every single piece of data I could pull for the different 80 something different cryptocurrencies we're evaluating with the program, uh, which gave us hundreds of thousands of data points in order to evaluate. 238% uh, sounds quite spectacular in 49 days, but in my back testing, I have times where in 49 days, we saw uh, a lot more than 238%. Some of them were at 400%, some of them were at uh, 900, 1,000%. We saw somewhere where you got 10 times your money in anywhere from 30 days to 90 days. I even had one instance where you got 23 times your money, 23x. That's 2,300% of the current, you know, the value of what you initially invested in just a very, very short period of time. I'm trying to remember, I don't recall off the top of my head how many days that was, but it was somewhere around the 60, 70, might have been 90 days, but for some reason I don't think it was quite that long. I'm going to have to look at that up again now that I'm thinking about it. Um, I did not specifically plan on mentioning that, but it came to mind as, as I was doing this video. All right, so with eToro, what's the catch? Is there a catch? Well, the catch is just setting everything up. That's the only catch with this. You know, the, the process you have to go through is you'll go to eToro's website and you'll sign up for an eToro account. eToro, because they are a regulated, they are regulated by many different governments. eToro originally started out in Australia, and so they were regulated by Australia to sell uh, stocks, and then they became regulated in the United Kingdom and the European Union and several others, and so they're regulated by a lot of different governments. They're also regulated in the United States, and so that requires them to ask you for uh, know your customer. KYC stands for know your customer information. 
That basically is like a photo ID and a couple of other pieces. Once you've passed the KYC step, then you'll want to deposit $200. And once you have $200, then you'll set up uh, the copy trading. And that's where on my page, you'll click this button here that says copy. So you'll look for my, my picture. You'll look for where it says Luminate Algo Trader. And then you'll click the copy button and it'll ask you how much do you want to copy Mark with his uh, algo trading and you'll put in $200 or more because $200 is the minimum that they allow and then uh, they don't charge you anything to do the copy trading and so that's actually really cool. Now the $50 limited offer bonus is eToro is allowing me to give $50 to the first 10 friends, family, or anybody watching this video that actually signs up and goes through this process. The first 10 people that begin to copy trade me will get $50 uh, within 30 to 45 days after they started to copy trade my account. And so you just need to go through the steps, sign up, pass the KYC, deposit $200, copy trade me, and you're on your way. And that $50 will show up in about 30 to 45 days. Now, in order to qualify for that $50, you do have to use this link here. The link is etoro.tw slash two capital S-D-I-O lowercase m in capital S. And so you'll need to use this link right here in order to copy, in order to get the $50 bonus. So to get this bonus, you have to use this link. And then once you use that link, sign up and go through the four easy steps that we mentioned. Once you've completed those four easy steps, um, which includes the depositing of $200 or more and then going to uh, my portfolio, my uh, channel, I don't, I'm trying to think of what they call it, uh, my, my thing on eToro. Uh, once you go to this web address, eToro People Illuminate Algo Trader, and tell them you want to copy me, then you'll get the $50 in a sh very short period of time. So how can I be of service to you? We're going to wrap up this video. It's a little bit longer. I'm sorry I got long winded with you, but I thought all of this was really important information. Do you have any questions? If you do, I'd love to answer them. Just leave me a message, uh, preferably on the YouTube channel. But if you're watching this somewhere else, uh, you can leave a message on the website that you're watching me from. How can I be of service to you? We'd love to hear your questions, your thoughts, whatever it is. Um, so please leave a message. In the meantime, I hope that you'll like, subscribe, and hodl, and do me a favor. Have a fantastic day.